Hello everyone, I am Revenano and this is Inverbus Virtus. This is a really interesting game I just picked up on Steam. It's a mage dungeon crawling RPG game where you cast spells, because you're a wizard obviously, but you pronounce spells using your microphone. Like you actually speak into a microphone and you pronounce the spell in order to cast it. And I thought, this is such an interesting concept, so I would love to play this game in general. And I thought, hey, I'm already going to be using my microphone, why not record it? I'm pretty sure you guys would love to see it. So I'm going to click New Game. Do you want to activate additional hints? If you choose OK, you'll get more directions about puzzles during the game. He's just saying anytime. I'm going to leave that on for now, because I don't know how difficult the puzzles in this game actually are. That was an interesting loading screen. Hopefully the music's not too loud. I spent uh, quite a bit of time toying around with the uh, volume there. And... I even turned it down even more, just kind of last minute there. Ooh! This looks promising. So, I'm gonna be... So... You can apparently s pronounce the spells in either English or in the language they created for this game. I'm gonna be using the language they created for this game, because because they said it's for best immersion. So, I'm gonna be saying some weird stuff. Uh, you'll hear me say some interesting things. But I think it's best for, like, the full immersion. Because that's what I want. What's he holding there? I just want to say, so far the game is gorgeous. Oh, a little bit of screen tearing there, I think. The music is amazing too. I think that's one of the best aspects of this game so far is the music. It is phenomenal. In verbis vertis. I have no idea if that's actually how you pronounce it, or if that's, I don't know, that's what I'm going with, in verbis vertus. Also, I think what I'm going to start doing in my videos now is I'm going to post uh, links to the game on Steam in the description. So, in the, the, the description of this series, I will post a link to this game if you so wish to buy it and play through it yourself. Oh, a little laggy there. I don't think this game is in early access. I think this is a full release. Whoa, what's going on? We're getting some freeze in here. Stuttering. Oof, the mouse. Um, sensitivity is not what I want it to be. Oops, that's game audio. Trolls. Uh, 45. Ah, that's much better. All right, we can sprint. Uh, there's a health bar up there, I can see it. Alright, so we're looking for some kind of forgotten temple, I think. Space bar, jump. Yay, a game where I can actually jump! Oh, whoops. Oh, uh, uh, I see, so that's for me to, like, get up if I fall. Okay, either that was leg or I got stuck. Wow. Whoa, f fucking sun with supernova. Oh, this game's so pretty. Whoa, uh, the texture popping. Hello. Caught you. Whoa. This is cool. I'm running inside. To examine an inscription, look at it closely and press E. Inscription. Where's the inscription? Was that a fly? Where's the inscription that it wants me to look at? Uh. Fuck. <laughs> that sounds really realistic, too, which is fucking annoying because I hate it when bugs fly like right next to my ear. It's one of the most annoying things in the world. Whoa! <laughs> that scared me a bit. Alright, so I guess we... Oh. I get a little bit of a frame drop when I activate these. Alright, I turned them all on. Now what? Door gonna open? No. Or I won't. Okay, so I activated all the glowing... Oh, did one of them fall over? Do I have to activate the fallen one? 
Yeah! Your journal has been updated. The Mahaki language. I spent years studying the idiom known as Mahaki, which means the language of the creative deities, yet yeah, I've only scratched the surface, although I had examined numerous artifacts that reported scriptures. That's not how you spell artifacts, by the way. In this language, coming from places even very far from each other, I've been able to interpret only a few fragments. Now in the entrance hall of this temple, whose existence is not even a certainty, something happened. I now have now I have a total understanding of the Mahaki. In the past, I did not believe in the legends, but there is power in these written characters. Okay, so we activate these stone obelisk, and like now we magically know like this entire foreign la ancient language. Um, shit, we're stuck. All right, into the uh, empty temple we go. What could possibly go wrong? Then inside the circle of remembrance to save game. New save game. Um, let's call it. Alright. Let's call it that. Oh, a map! Um, okay. Where am I? I am assuming I am here at that X. So, it looks like the passage goes and then there's an I and a big chamber and then more of these symbols and then mushrooms and then gems. Yep! <laughs> Oh well, at least I know the general layout. Oh wow, this game is pretty. Aside from some texture pop in, some lag. Ah, that's not half. Wait, is that fire effect in the fire effect? The fire is on fire. That's pretty. Oh, this game is pretty. Um, so there's a chamber like to the left here, apparently. Oh, I can't see shit. Oh. Um, what just happened? I think I fell down a pit. All right, I'm not going to go that way. I'm going to go back the other way. I'm going this way where I can actually kind of see. All right, I can't go that way. A spell that would enable me to cast light. What is this? Uh, apparently it's nothing. A source of light would be great. Like a portable one. Ooh, some kind of library maybe? Can I click on anything here? Um, oh. This area actually kind of is very sky- I got stuck in that chair. Uh oh. I'm getting stuck in the furniture. That's not a good sign. Uh, no, I think that's an invisible wall, actually. Wow, that's that a really... There's an invisible wall right here that I can't, can't go past. Like, right here, there's an invisible wall. That's really, really weird. What is this? Apparently, it's nothing. Alright, that's a dead end. Portable map would have been nice, too. Wait, is there one in my journal? Yeah, I love how there's like all these buttons over here on the right hand side of like change section and everything. <laughs> Yet I'm not using the gamepad at all. I don't even have one plugged in. I hear wall shifting. Whoa, what's this? Oh, look at the reflections. Oh, those are some good reflections. Although I can't see myself in them. Light. The light is not enemy of darkness. Quite the contrary, it is complimentary. A sister prays too much in the past. The world is based on this lie. The belief that the light is necessarily represent the good that is opposed to the shadows bans them. The balance between the two has always been in favor of blazing bright part of creation, but no one has ever realized the importance of equality between them. Light and shadow are the same intent entity, the same essence pervading the cosmos. When one of the two fails, change is inevitable. Nothing remains equal to itself over time, and the metamorphosis does not always lead to order or chaos. I can feel it. The dazzling power of light coming from my hand, an absolute sense of grace radiate from my hand after I sit. Apparently I can click this. I'm going to click that before I actually try to pronounce it. And after I said, for the first time, and darkness knelt before me. Um... Lume Tial. Lume Tial. Okay. 
Let's, let's try that. You just launched a spell. This formula has been already in your journal. To cast a spell, press and hold the left mouse button or gamepad right trigger and pronounce the formula. Then release the button. To end the spell, press the right mouse button. Okay. Illumitiel. Let's try again. Illumitiel. Can you pronounce that again? Illumitiel. Illumitiel. I may have to change it to English, guys. Illumitiel. Either it's not picking me up very well. Lume Tiao. Lume Tiao. Uh, let's go to the options because I just want to check something. Uh, controls. Cancel. Speech recognition. Here's what we want. Let's change it to English. Let's see what happens. Same game. Um, let there be light. Let there be light. Let there be light. Shit, this is not good. Let there be light. I did it! And there was light! Alright, I'm just gonna adjust my headset here so my mic is... Maybe it just... Maybe it's just having problems picking up my voice. Alright, I'm gonna... I at least know... Okay, it's picking up my voice, but quietly. I'm gonna change it back. Alright. Alright, we now have a portable source of light. Alright, maybe my microphone was just too far away from my face. I've adjusted my headset so it's closer. Whoa! What happened? Did you steal my light? Screw you. Lume TL. Lume TL. Ah, uh, it's this room of absolute shit. Uh, this thing needs to work better. Yeah, see, look at my microphone input. It's like so low. Can I not crank that up a bit? I think that's just the thing. I think it's just having a lot of problems. I'm just gonna move my mic. Interesting. Uh, speech recognition. I'm gonna change it back to English for now. Let there be light. Ah, oh, come on, work, damn you. Let there be light. I got to work once before. Let there be light. Okay, there we go. Yeah, that is really finicky. I may need to adjust my microphone for this. Alright, let's go back into this room. Yeah, see, there's a... Here's why I died when I entered this room. Or I didn't die, I just fell and took damage. Please don't run out on me. Oh, that was great. Auto save. Yeah, I think that weird stone that I walked past in that hallway... I think that, like, disables your spell. Alright, I don't mean really need that. Wow! Oh, boy! Oh, is that another spell altar down there? Oh, look at the floating rocks! Wow, this is amazing environment design. Oh, wow! Oh, safe state. Cool. Oh, what happened there? Alright, I'm going to save here. And I am out of time for this episode. Yes. Alright, I'm out of time for this episode, guys. I'm going to uh, end this episode here. And... I'm going to exit the game for a bit after I, and I'm going to play around with my microphone because I just think it's it can't pick up my microphone very well. I think I need to make my microphone much more sensitive. So thank you so much for watching. 
Uh, remember, if you're liking this game and this series, uh, subscribe to Stay Up To Date and leave a like and favorite. And feel free to post a comment down below. And I will see you all next time.